So it looks like we approached the first uh, crossroads. But yeah, we just follow the turtles. There's a crossroads here. It looks like that is the way to go.
So we found this cool place for hikers to come to and rest. So this is my meal, nothing really too fancy. So we, uh, it's gotten dark on us. We are about to just hike a little bit through the night. We're gonna go on and uh, start heading on back. We completed the first section, so I think we're gonna call it with that and Try to get back to the car. Probably not going to make it back tonight. Might camp. But yeah, we'll see. We're about halfway out of here. Something like that. We uh, wanted to take a little break. And um, yeah, we, we decided we're just going to head out tonight. So we just, we kind of figured out what we needed to figure out and that was test our gear out, kind of just test out the environment and just, just a test in general, really. So yeah, we're going to head out tonight. We're almost back. So yeah, this is probably going to be the end of the video. We ended up doing the hike all in about around 12 hours. It was a total of 20 miles, 10 in and 10 out. We did the first section and then we chose not to stay the night because our gear, we had, I had about 20 pounds, 21 maybe with the water added. I think my brother's pack was around 18 pounds. My bag was just not made for backpacking. It was really inconvenient, didn't really have any straps, no latches, no, no way to really attach things to the back of it very easily. The part that I did have it attached to was not really something I wanted to rely on for a few days. And yeah, I just had like a hammock set up too and I didn't really like that with the possible chance of rain. I wanted a real tent instead of a hammock set up. So yeah, we just, we want to get a little bit more prepared and then we're going to go back out there and try it again. But maybe do the second section, maybe do more. We'll just have to see. Thanks for watching.